everyone! I'm back with a bit more Pokemon Black and I'm well again! So yes, I sound normal this episode. Anyway, so last time we got up to the gym leader. Um, I've done an itty bit of off-screen training, so let's have a look. It didn't really train up everyone, he didn't really need it. But um, Emperor's up to level 32, Pipsqueak's level 31, E.T.'s level 30, uh, Scrooge hasn't changed, it's still level 28. Brock hasn't changed, level 31. And Fang's level 30. Fang needed the most training to be quite honest, but we've done it! So now we're ready to take on the gym leader. Alright, let's get past the token. Clay. Like the mud. Clay, is that really a name? Are there people out there called Clay? <laughs> hey, I'm Clay. How you doing? I don't, I don't know why you just not sort of turned Australian. Never mind. I really like Rocker Rocks. I'm using one in my um. I can't remember if I'm playing black or white too. I think I'm playing white too. Anyway. Oh wait, I have one! I like it! That, that was the my point of that story. It was quite funky when I was doing my uh, training up for this. I put on the um. I put in a code so everything was shiny, yeah. Just to make it a bit more fun. Blue nose diglets and all that da and all that jazz. So, but my question for that was, who has a favourite shiny Pokemon? Who who do you think is the best one? Like, it could be colour wise or just Pokemon wise. I really like the shiny Shuckles. I'm not just saying that. I like them because they're blue. Oh, I'd love a shiny Shuckle. Now that that would be Shuck Norris. That will be the Shuck Norrises of all Shuck Norrises. The shiny Shuck Norris. Oh, extras are scary. <laughs> I don't like them, they took me on edge. Only when I'm fighting one. If I had one, I wouldn't be on edge. Emperor's doing alright. Oh, I spoke too soon. Oh, but it's okay. It's okay. Alright, I'm alive. Um, yeah, we need to do some Scrooge training at some point. I want him. To, I, I purposely didn't touch Scrooge because I want him to evolve on screen. You know, into my beautiful magma. What is that? A palpitoad. Wow, that's ugly. I don't like it. Somehow it reminds me of a foot. I don't know why. It reminds me, I, I know that sounds weird, but the first thing that comes to mind when I look at it is foot. Anybody agree with me? There we go, there's another question. What's the first thing that comes to mind when you look at a palpitoad? Oh, oh, oh. I really would have been upset. I really, really, genuinely would have been upset. Not as upset, upset as in the world. Like that. I'll get the words out, hold on. Not as upset as when Shuckle died. And I know that sounds mean to Pipsqueak. You're not quite a Shuckle. Now I really don't like the little foot over there. I wanna go do new Pokemon route catching! And now I've gotta do the gyms to get to the end, but it's not the point. And it's down! Oh, Pipsqueak got a level as well. You deserve that, Pipsqueak. You deserve that level. You take that level with pride. Another gym badge for moi. Bit of a boring badge, isn't it? I'm not, I'm not a fan of the badge sets in this. I don't like them being all long, shall we say. 
I just don't like it. I mean, it's vertical, horizontal, whatever. They're still long looking. But okay, my well, my favourite set of badges are actually like the first set of badges. I, you know, Boulder, Cascade, Volcano, that lot. I just like them. I think they're nice looking. They're simple, yet effective. They do their job. They serve their purpose. They're not over the top. These I just find a bit boring. I suppose there was probably another satellite. I never understood why the Earth badge at the end, though, was a different shape than all the others. All the rest are sort of round. Like, you know, they, they have a circle in them. Like, they're based around a circle. But no. Earth badge looks like a leaf. Whatever. It's like the designers just ignored that part. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll do that. The Earth! The Earth is round! Would you not use that? It's called the Earth badge! Alright, I'm going to start with my theory of the Earth badge. Okay. I need to do some shopping. I want a new route, come on! There's some more Pokemon catching. I want something really epic. Oh, we'll get some repels. I've got to go through. I think it's a cave. So I, I, I don't like caves. I'm not a cave fan in the slightest. They make me want to cry. It's how I became to hate the Zubat. And the Jigglypuff. And the Clefairy. And I'm sure everybody out there knows I'm referring to Mount Moon. Oh my god. It put me off the caves for life in these games. Oh, it's Bianca! She's put me off talking to people in this game for life. Oh. No, don't fight me! Why is she holding her hat on her? Is she straightening her hat? Holding her hat? With a devil horns? Look, can you see them? Emperor. I don't feel like I'm very along level wise, so the amount of badges that I'm on, I feel like I should be a little higher by now. But you know, it is the right level. The gym leader only had like 30 something. Oh, there we go, fake ring. Um, 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 yeah, no. Yeah, why not? I hate learning new moves, especially when you've got a set of four moves that you're, you really like, like you're really quite happy with them. And then you get another move come along that is really good. And you know you should use it. But then you don't want to get rid of the other four moves. It's not, it's just horrible. I hate it. But then you don't want to forget the move because you know you won't learn it again. And there's probably not a TM for it. And... The game just mean like this. There's just not enough options. I'm sorry. I really don't have anything against monkeys. It's just, I just don't like them in Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, I think I'll switch Pokemon. Come on, Scrooge, one more level. See, most of the Pokemon, when they go into their final form, I usually like usually quite elegant, quite strong looking. Pig just looks fat. It really does. It's just a big round pork. It really is. Not that one. Fang don't look great from this angle either though. I thought that was going to do more than that. 
Go away, Bianca! <laughs> For anyone British who's watching this, this is just a question. Or anybody who's watched EastEnders, whenever you see Bianca, what other name would you want to shout? I just want to see if I'm not going to tell anyone. I just want to. Oh, I've got a flyer, yay! I just want to see if anybody, you know, when you hear the name Bianca, what other name, man's name, comes to mind that you want to shout? If you watch EastEnders, that is. I don't know if the rest of the world watches EastEnders. I've never really, you know, bothered to think about it. Right, let's be off. Oh, oh, new route, new route. Grass, yes, grass. Um, let's have a little switch. Ah, um, yeah. Um. Please be something good. Oh, it's a. What is that? I haven't. Is that another one of those Reggie things? Oh, a Reggie S. Okay. Does this one... Does this one blow up as well? <gasps> oh no, what if it blows up? Last time I come across one of these, it blew up. Oh, no, oh should I just take its experience and go? I'll take its experience and go. Can I kill it? Please kill it. I killed my baby. This is probably the only Reggie thing that I haven't seen yet. I think it was a Reggie rock that kept blowing me up last time. Ah. Uh, oh no. Oh, please don't kill Fang! Yeah! Fang, you're a beast! Because I only just got you! Don't go now! Oh, is that handle? Why could I have that? Oh. It, could have, it could have been like I was doing my oven. I do love my Houndoon, by the way. And I know everybody loves Houndoon, but it's not the point. Here's Pokemon. William! Oh, that one's pretty. Come on, you need to be level 30. Oh, I never changed its stain, it's still scrunch. You need another iron in there, Scrooge. Oh, Scrooge will become Scrooge. That wasn't enough experience for my liking, William. Blows up. I should just throw a bullet in and hope for the best. Oh, look, it's barking at me. Ah! Oh. What one? Eh, rock and roller. What the hell? I got every. I got the most rubbish one. Well, not rubbish, you know. But I had to get the one that blew up out of all the Pokemon that were had like quite nice potential in this grass. Hey, give me something good after I get the first one. Ugh. Yeah, I, to, ugh, I give up. I actually, <laughs> please, I might just use a repel. Yeah. 
It's just taunting me now. It's just going, ha ha! Doesn't want a new Pokemon. Is not so much to ask? We're going down, flying rat. Rock, you also need to hurry up and get to thirty five so I can find a steelix. I can't be bothered to do the whole trading stuff with yourself for save files and whatnot. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna throw a Steelix into the grass and catch it. Seems like the easiest thing to do. If anybody's got any fancier ideas of how to get the Steelix, let me know, and I'll do it. It's not going to give me very much experience though. But all experience is good at this point. I want you to evolve this episode, goddammit! Oh, come on, die! Yes, they die, they don't faint, they die. They don't want to tell. I'm getting close, one or two more. One or two. We'll be at 30. It's a cherry berry. Thanks. Because I really wanted that. Potion time! Scrooge. Not losing you now. You, you, will you fight me? Fight me! Yay! This foot evolved from that. He does, doesn't he? That's why he looks like a baby foot. He's got the things on his head, I don't know. Time foot. Why does Fang flash? Does anybody know? When I send Fang out, he sort of the yellow bits go white. Is it is it meant to be electricity? I would have thought so. But... Oh look, she's got another one. Two feet. Oh and another one. I couldn't even use Scrooge. Oh, would you stop with the same Pokemon? Oh! I'll get up to the cave for this episode, and if Magby hasn't evolved by then, so be it. It'll be next episode. I at least got the badge. Ron! Where's Harry? <laughs> Sorry, I've been watching a bit of Harry Potter today. Apparently a bit too much. That's actually his patron. Right, come on! Yay! Screwed! Yay! I got my magma! Evolve! Evolve! Yay! 
That's what I wanted. Bye, Magby. Hello, Magma. Hurry up, Magma. There we go. Ah, look at you. Little fire duck. Now he looks beastly. There we go, there's Magma. And as it's evolved, I will actually leave the episode here and next episode we'll come back and we'll do the cavey bit. Yeah. Ugh. I'm excited really. <laughs> anyway, okay, so I'll see you next episode guys. We'll do the cave. Bye!